my dear students this video is for ssc march 2022 examination here the concept wise they are decreasing the 20% portions from that i am going to say today arithmetic progression in this examination uh, from the arithmetic progression there will be a nine marks to so clear now the marks how they are distributed one marks plus two marks plus two marks plus three marks are one marks may be increased and if they are given one more marks for one and this is two and this is two and this is for three marks see my dear children here i have given an important points in arithmetic progression from this points only you will get it one 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 marks from this points only see first let us learn ap means arithmetic progression general form of ap is a comma a plus b comma a plus b you should know very well and from this only they may ask one last question next second part is finding the first term and common difference from the formula what are the formula means here here they given here you know already the term formula a n equals a plus n minus 1 into d from this formula they will select the one more question and second one a n equals they will be giving in this way 2n plus 1 time r 2n minus 1 time this type of formula they will be giving and one marks question will get in the examination either it may be multiple choice or it may be one marks question next start now find the sum of the terms using the formulas see terms means see here sum of the terms previously we use terms only terms finding the number of terms or first term or common difference d here in the third one we are finding the sum of the terms using the formula here we have two formulas are very important that should be in your mind sn equals n by 2 inside the small bracket 2a plus n minus 1 complete the bracket into d complete the square bracket this is by one formula we are going to find the sum of the terms in arithmetic progression second formula we are using sn equals n by 2 inside the square bracket a is the first term plus l is the last term or you can use also a l here a plus a l also you can use or a plus l also you can use from this two formulas we are going to find the sum of the terms in ap next see look at children here i wrote sum of the first n natural numbers using this from 1 to n summation of n equals n into n plus 1 divided by 2 using this formula they may also find the sum of natural numbers or sum of even numbers or sum of odd numbers we can find out from this also they may you one or two marks from this and next one marks question for this sum of the first n odd natural numbers equals n square this is one marks question in multiple choice or in one mark ha ah, second one sum of the first n even natural numbers equals n into n plus 1 inside the small bracket from this one they may select one marks i told you already the two marks and next three marks sum i will be discussing in the next video see children i from this only how they will be asking terms how to find the one mark questions i given the some examples here find the 10th term of ap if a n equals 2 n minus 5 here i told you know 2 n plus 1 type this way they may be giving 2 n plus 1 type or uh, they may give me 2 n minus 5 here <coughs> we have to find the 10th term which is given are regular a n equals 2 n minus 5 here a 10 means n equals 10 a 10 equals equal to lens where there is n here you should write a substitute 10 here 10 minus 5 
क्या चल रहा है टू इनटू टेन इक्वल्स ट्वेंटी माइनस फाइव क्या ए डेफोर क्यों रह गया ट्वेंटी माइनस फाइव इज फिफ्टीन चल रहा है दिस इज ए टेन यू रह डेफोर ए टेन इक्वल्स फिफ्टीन दिस टाइप ऑफ वन मार्क्स क्वेश्चंस दे विल बी आस्किंग दिस इट विल बी द आंसर I hope that students this you can easily understand. Next, the second example in an AP. If a n equals n square plus four, then find a two means second term. Now use this formula here. a n equals n square plus four. Where there is an n, there is write up a two here. A two equals here you write two square plus four. Then two square means two into two it becomes a four plus four. Then it will becomes eight. Therefore, children here A two equals eight. This is the answer. In this way, the one mark question will be asking from here only. Please start. Okay, children. A n equals n square plus four is that? Here I wrote here a two equals two square. Instead of n here I wrote two. Why? Because find the a two means second term. That's why where there is an n there I wrote two. It becomes a square plus four. Two square means four plus four. Four plus four. We'll say eight. Therefore a two equals eight. This is the answer. This type of questions one marks questions. Will be that. I now find the fifteenth term of AP. Three comma eight comma thirteen. This is an AP. Okay, here here. How to solve this terms? Means here this is a two marks question. Children, here three eight thirteen and so on. A equals first term is three. Next common difference. Common difference means C comma D common difference that is equal to D equals eight minus C. This is the second term. This is A one. This is A two, and this is A three. A two minus A one. Eight minus two. Eight minus sorry, it is a three. Then it becomes eight minus three is five. And then A n equals fifteen. Now use the formula of a n equals a plus n minus one into d. Here children, a equals three plus n means how many terms? Fifteen terms. Fifteen minus one into d means five. Here children, three n three only plus fifteen minus one is. Fourteen into five, and here three plus fourteen into five. For example, twenty plus five hundred eight plus two is seventy equals seventy three. That is a fifteen. See the a fifteen term of a b is seventy three. This is the answer. So let's. This is the two mark sums. You can do it step by step. Because in the sums, in the examination, they give the marks, but to the steps only. And look here now. Find the sum of the first twenty terms of A P. The given here A P five plus ten plus fifty. So on by formula. This is also two marks sums. Now here A equals five. Common difference equals ten minus five equals five, and then sum of the first twenty terms n equals how much? Twenty. Here, children, yes, n equals n by two. You say this for a minute. Two a plus n minus. One 
inside the small bracket n minus 1 into d complete the square bracket here n is that a, a is here and d is that and here n is uh, 20 terms n is equal to here now yes 20 equals n equals 20 by 2 inside the square bracket 2 into a a means 5 plus n means 20 minus 1 complete the bracket d equals 5 complete the square bracket also here 2 ones are 2 tens are here 10 inside the square bracket 2 fives are 2 good here 2 fives are 10 again plus n means 20 minus 1 19 into 5 complete this and equals 10 10 as it is plus 19 fives are and 5 nines are 45 means right here 5 4 here 5 and the 5 plus 4 95 here 10 first we add this 95 plus n is 1 not 5 equals 10 into 1 not 5 is 1050 this is yes 20 sum of see here children the sum of the first 20 terms equals 1050 this is the answer this is for 2 marks now the one more sum I join type of the sums find the sum of 5 plus 8 plus 11 to 10 terms by formula means by using the formula that. now see here a 5 is there plus 8 plus 11 up to 10 terms a equals 5 common difference equals 8 minus 5 5 minus 6 5 is 3 and n equals 10 terms see use the formula here sum of arithmetic progression means here s n equals n by 2 inside the square bracket 2a plus n minus 1 into d complete the square bracket substitute the values here a is equal to 5 and n is equal to 10 and common difference d is equal to 3 here n is equal to 10 by 2 next 2 into a means 5 plus n is 10 minus 1 into these 3 complete the square bracket here 2 ones are 2 fives are means here we got it 5 next 2 fives are 10 plus 10 minus 1 is 9 into 3 complete the bracket here children 5 inside the square bracket 10 plus 9 3 is 27 children don't add 10 plus 9 please but the side of some first you get this 9 to read it then you can add this one here 5 inside the square bracket 10 plus 27 is how much? 37 let's multiply it here 5 7 there. 5 35 no? 3 here 5 3 is 15 15 plus 3 18 185 therefore yes sir 10 equals 185 is the answer my dear children here today I have explained about the 1 marks questions and 2 marks question 
in the next video next three marks are four marks questions i'll be explaining please observe it and get nine out of nine in the arithmetic progression please subscribe with and tell, thank you very much